Testing specification monitoring may require making dilutions of your prepared sample. In part 1, we created a 1 to 10 dilution. Now let's make serial dilutions from 1 to 100 to 1 to 100,000. Place 11 milliliters of your 1 to 10 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. Homogenize thoroughly. You now have a 1 to 100 dilution. Repeat this process as necessary up to a dilution of 1 to 100,000 and beyond. For less than 10 CFU per gram, use a 1 to 10 sample dilution. For less than 100 CFU per gram, transfer 11 milliliters of a 1 to 10 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. For less than 1,000 CFUs per gram, transfer 11 milliliters of 1 to 100 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. For less than 10,000 CFUs per gram, transfer 11 milliliters of 1 to 1,000 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. For 100,000 CFUs per gram, transfer 11 milliliters of 1 to 10,000 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. Alternatively, some dilutions can be skipped to reduce materials required. For 1,000 CFUs per gram, transfer 1 milliliter of 1 to 10 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. For less than 100,000 CFUs per gram, transfer 1 milliliter of 1 to 1,000 sample into 99 milliliters of buffer. Select the specification monitoring vial of choice. If refrigerated, remove from the fridge 30 minutes prior to inoculation. Supplement the vial as necessary. See kit insert for rehydration and supplement instructions. Transfer the appropriate amount of sample to the vial. Secure the vial lid. Gently invert the vial three times and place in a vial rack. Repeat as needed for necessary specification vials. Once all specification monitoring sample preparation is complete, place the original 1 to 10 dilution sample vessel in the 35 centigrade incubator for 18 to 24 hours if testing for objectionable organisms. Dispose of all materials as biohazardous waste in accordance with all federal, state, and local regulations. Please contact Neogen Technical Services with any questions.